Okay guys, so I'm having a problem with my jake brake. Jake brake, cruise control not working. It sucks, especially going down the mountains, 80,000 pounds, and your jake brake doesn't want to work. So I did some research and basically uh, it all comes down to replacing the clutch switch. Now there is other switches to replace if that doesn't work. And uh, I will make another video on that if that's you know if I replace the switch and it doesn't work but let's just make a video on replacing the switch there's a lot of videos on YouTube about replacing the switch it's not that hard but I'm just gonna show you how I replace mine it's right here this is the clutch okay and I have to basically remove this whole thing the switch is hanging here it's this guy right here it's dark you can see but um so I will remove this because it's easier to do it removing it the whole thing. So, so be able to remove it, I gotta come right here and uh, look to see where it's at. And I know it's gonna be a little bit of a pain in the butt, but all the videos show there is kind of easy. So. I'll figure out where is that. I'll take the bolt and remove it and then show you guys from there. Hopefully it is easy to remove it. I think mine is the same as those videos I was watching. There's a lot of stuff in the way. I'm not a mechanic but you know what? I'm not going to let that intimidate me. And uh, you know, let's do, oh it's right here. Okay, so it's right here. And there's one and then it's two. And three and then four. Four bolts and remove this. You don't have to remove the pump. You just remove this nice and carefully out of there. Disconnect the switch, put the new switch on, connect it, and just put the bolts back on again and it's all over. So it doesn't look that hard to do. Let's get it done and I'll show you guys. 